there, welcome back to another SpaceX update video. The second Starship launch could happen any day now. Yesterday, on the opening day of World Satellite Business Week, SpaceX's Senior Vice President of Commercial Business, Tom Ocanero, said that the company is very close to the second Starship launch. He said that the company is working closely with the FAA to obtain a launch license. Telesat announced on Monday that it has reached an agreement with SpaceX to launch its satellite broadband constellation, Telesat Lightspeed, to low Earth orbit. The Canadian satellite operator has purchased 14 Falcon 9 launches from SpaceX to deliver a total of 252 satellites into orbit. The first launch is expected no earlier than 2025. The company chose SpaceX because of its excellent track record and being the most reliable launch provider in the business. After Booster 10 was rolled to Massey's site for testing, Booster 11 took its place inside the Mega Bay. Yesterday, at 11.57 p.m. Pacific Time, SpaceX launched its 64th mission of the Four, year. 3, 2, 1, ignition. Lift off the Falcon 9. Go SpaceX. Go Starlink Group 7-2. Falcon 9 is fishing down range. The Starlink Group 7-2 mission was launched atop a Falcon 9 rocket from Space Launch Complex 4E at Vandenberg Space Force Base in California. The first stage Falcon 9 booster stage supporting two, this FPS mission, B-1071, was on its 11th flight. Landing leg deploy. Stage 1 landing confirmed. About an hour later, the latest batch of 21 Starlink satellites was deployed successfully. That is it for now. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.